Hi guys, Butters Bridge here, uh, and it's just turned six o'clock uh, on a Wednesday afternoon, which means there's a new team of the week out. Not particularly good, I don't think, for the gold players this week, but I've just realised it's been that long since I've done a Road to Ronaldo episode, or Road to Real Madrid, as I tend to call it. Uh, I thought we'll, we'll open some uh, gold packs for a bit of fun. So, I'm recording this one live now, so we're going to get straight on. As usual, with my gold ones, I just tend to go for the 15k packs. So I'm probably I'm only going to open probably about four or five. Don't want to spend all my coins while it's not that good. But uh, we'll see if we can get anything decent, maybe an inform, or hopefully if we can get a Ronaldo, I'll be very very happy. So here we go, pack number one, and it looks like the best player there looks like it's Del Piero, <laughs> which doesn't look like it's a good start. Um, I don't even know if he's worth. Might just keep him in the trade pile and we'll list him up. 150 coins and we'll see from there um, I'm just going to save some of these gold contracts uh, I don't think that Amenki is worth much um, so I'll just leave him a load of player contract uh, formation cards sorry but they're all rubbish so we'll discard all them we'll go straight on to pack number two let's see if we can get a bit better in this one uh, I mean what are your views on team of the week uh, I particularly don't think it's it's that good. Even the bronze, which I was looking forward when I saw there was a bronze in there, uh, he's pretty rubbish rating. So, so here we go. No, oh, one of the only Everton players who's not been given an inform, Tim Kale. So, who, oh, we got Pato. I didn't notice him then. Uh, not too bad of a pack. I don't think he's worth that much anymore. Like, but I'm not going to complain. Pull Pato in a pack. Um, couple more. Of the rare contracts, I'll send them straight to the club. And you know, I'm going to send these ones straight to the trade pal because I can make a bit of money off them. I say I'm only opening four packs, so I've got plenty of space for any duplicate players if I do pull them. So that's about it for pack number two. It's not too bad, a little bit better. We're improving. Let's see if we can improve a little bit more again with this next pack. Let's hope we can get something decent. Here we go, and oh, that looks pretty rubbish. I think that's Quantro, or whatever his name is, uh, on the left. Woodgate, I don't even know if he's worth saving, so I'm not going to bother. Just discard him. Um, a few contracts, make a bit of money back on them. I think they're rising slightly at the moment, so they've gone up a bit in price. Uh, squad fitness, which is still fairly cheap for gold. There's not much difference really between a bronze and a gold on that. Well, I'll stick him in the trade pile, stick him up 150 start price and see if he can make any money. So yeah, pack number three, not very good. Uh, go on, we'll go on for this one here. Probably the last pack, pack number four, but we'll see. <laughs> I might be tempted to open another one if uh, they're pretty rubbish. And that looks pretty rubbish. Although there is a free pack there, I think I can see. Hiding through the middle. I think there was a look at that, not even a rare player. In fact, not even a good player. A lot of rubbish. So let's take all these straight in my trade pile. And do you know what? Um, they'll probably be do you know what? I'll just open the free pack and that'll be it, I think. I'm not wasting my coins this week. On packs, I say I'm only just doing this as a bit of a bonus episode. Uh, for my subscribers who've been watching, I hope you're enjoying the videos. I hope you're enjoying the new series, my bronze one, clearing out my club. It's going to take me a while, I think, considering I've got that many players, but I think it'll be worthwhile and it'll be interesting to see at the end how much money I, I'll have actually made just from opening bronze packs. That's the ultimate goal for myself, just to see how profitable it has been. And part of it is looking back for me and uh, actually seeing. If I want to bought any gold packs earlier on when I got up to the coins, how much I would have actually got? I mean, I, mean, I possibly would have been up near a million because I've earned what a hundred k in what was it about five weeks? And saying that I had two weeks off where I didn't really open any packs. So, so here's the free pack, and that looks even worse than all the other ones. Yeah, a load of rubbish. But saying that there's a few consumables there which I'll get rid of. So yeah, so there we go. The episode. Four, I think it is, of the Road to Ronaldo. Turns out, not very good. I've got Pato. Can't complain really at that. 
he's a nice decent player. I uh, don't know how much I'll get for him, mate, but he'll be going up on the market. Probably at 150 start price in the, in the next 10 minutes, I'd have thought. Um, so yeah, I'd just like to say thank you for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you like my videos uh, and you want to see more of them. Uh, and follow me on Twitter, at Buttersbridge. Uh, again, if you want to get involved with a bit of banter, you want to ask me any questions, you can do it on there or you can leave uh, comments at the bottom of this YouTube page. Or uh, contact me uh, privately on YouTube if you've got anything private inquiries. As long as you're not asking for coins. <laughs> but uh, there you go. Uh, until next time, guys. I'll see you later.